Do you know that one of the greatest advantages of glass over plastic is its natural environmental friendliness? As objects made of glass have a much longer life than plastic, helping to reduce waste. And in addition, that glass is completely recyclable and it does not harm the natural environment. So what if people's demand for glassware is increasing? Will manufacturing factories respond in time? Follow us through the video below. The Mass Production of Glass Bottles Today there are many objects made of glass, in many different shapes, and in particular, glass bottles are increasingly popular and widely used, especially the glass bottles that are not only used to hold drinks and food, but also can be used for display to create a luxurious space. The main raw material for producing glass bottles is silica sand, also known as quartz sand. If you use a clean sand not mixed with iron, it will create the most transparent glass. And at the same time, it is also possible to add other additives based on the needs and purpose of use. Besides the production of glass bottles and jars in modern factory, the manual production process is usually carried out by skilled people, so the product quality is ensured. As I strongly believe that if we support the traditional techniques of the craft, they will continue to operate and produce high quality glass crafts for many years to come. As in general, the production of glass bottles is quite simple, including the steps such as preparing and melting the raw materials, shaping the products according to the molds, and finally, cooling and finishing the products. As the process of producing glass bottles in the factory sounds very simple, but they need a lot of equipment to mass produce a quality glass bottle. First, the raw materials are fed into the hopper in proper portion. Then it's mixed and transferred to the kill. On the conveyor belt, they use magnets to remove any iron material present in the mixture. Kiln, they mix the materials and are heated and melted at a high temperature. From there, the raw material will form a liquid glass and underglow the bowing molding, so that it is uniform and it meets the mold requirements. In the glass bottle factory, the glass kiln operates 24-7 and it is under human control. After that, the liquid glass is poured into an existing mold machine with a certain shape and blown nitro gas to shape. Most factories use iron to make the mold machines for the glass industry. But the best material for the mold is always steel, which is what they started using in recent years. They would rather give up a part of the profit to get the best mold quality because this is the foundation of a stable quality glass product. 
depending on the purpose of each factory and the mold machine system, to produce the glass bottles with different shapes. When the shape is formed, it is removed from the mold. And finally, the glass bottles are checked for quality and gradually cooled to achieve the required hardness. Then they are closed and stored for the consumer. Glass bottles are also recyclable and reusable to minimize their impact on the environment, as recycling glass bottles saves resources and reduces waste, as glass can be recycled multiple times, and recycled glass container can be produced in as little as 30 days. By this production method, the glass bottles from the trash can be turned into a useful item for society. Glass bottles for individuals will give consumers a feeling of familiarity, closeness, and also great sense of security when using, as most of the glass bottles are designed with a tall, tapered shape that is convenient for users to hold in their hands and easy to drink. In addition, the bottle is very easy to clean because of its smoothness and it can be used for a long time. And instead of using plastic bottles, we should use glass bottles to protect our environment. What do you think about these transparent and useful glass bottles? Let us know in the comments below and don't forget to click the like, share and subscribe button to support us and have more motivation to make more good videos. And for now, goodbye and see you in the next video.